I don't know if it's always like this, but this one to me is <laughs> a little bit messy. It's kind of getting everywhere. Hey guys, welcome to the video. In today's video, I'm going to be testing out some of the new items at Costco or newer items at Costco. I think they've been there for a little while, but I haven't tried any of these yet. One of these is actually my wife's, but she's gonna let me have a bite of it so I can uh, see what it's all about. So um, I got the cookie here, which I'm very excited for, and it definitely looks good. Um, we got, this is called the rotisserie chicken Caesar salad. And then here, um, this is called the Turkey Swiss Sandwich. So, um, let's start. Let me show you this. Um, this sauce I was reading, I think it's a mayo, must a mayo mustard sauce is what this is. And honestly, I don't know. You know, I'm not usually a big mayo fan, but we'll see. That's what it looks like. Um, and then we have, you know, there's a lot of turkey here. It's actually kind of kind of frozen like that's ice um some more turkey then we have some cheese here that must be the the mayo i don't know what's on top then maybe that's the mustard or whatever sauce it is um that's what it looks like <laughs> so and then i do like this style of bread um it's kind of like a, a tougher style bread so okay let me take a bite of this It's actually really good to me it tastes really fresh um you know in my opinion i think this is healthier than some of the other options so um i definitely like this it is dripping some water like i said i think the turkey was kind of like like frozen mm. i still don't know what this sauce is I, I don't know i can't really taste what it is okay now, I'll come back to this. I'm going to let my wife eat her salad. I'll take a bite of it and let you guys know what I think. But in this one, there's, there's you know, cheese. There's the rotisserie chicken. Um, they give you some dressing here. That's what that one looks like. But let's take a bite before I finish the sandwich. Let's take a bite of this cookie here. This is really good. This is what I expected this to taste like. Mmm. It's warm. It's kind of a little bit harder on the outside and then kind of soft in the middle. Or softer in the middle. It's incredibly good. Um, it's what I expected. This, this is a good cookie. I'll definitely be getting this again. So, alright guys. I'll be back. I'll let my wife start eating her salad. She said I, I can have a bite, so I'll, I'll do that so you guys can see and just I'll give my opinion of it. Um, but yeah, I, I like these new options. I like the sandwich because to me it feels like a healthier option, um, you know, than some of the other things that I could be eating. Um, so I do like this. Um, I don't know if there's a way, but if if I had a way to, I, I didn't see it when I was ordering, but I would get it without the mayo. And honestly, I'd probably get it without both sauces because I'm not like a huge sauce guy. But uh, that being said, the sauces of, that are on there, I don't really taste them too much. So they're not really like impacting the, the flavor of the sandwich in my opinion. So, all right guys, I'll be back. The turkey is really thick in there, too. That's nice. I like that. I don't know if it's always like this, but this one, to me, is <laughs> a little bit messy. It's kind of getting everywhere. 
Um, I don't know. I don't know if it was like the because the the turkey was frozen or what, but it is a little bit messy. I mean, you can see I'm I'm making a mess, but okay, guys, I'm gonna keep eating this, and I'll be back shortly. All right, guys, so I finished eating the sandwich, and it was really good. You know, um, the only things that, like I said, I would change, um, I'm not a huge sauce guy, so if I had the opportunity, I don't know if it's customizable, but I would uh, not get the mayo and whatever the other sauce was. I think it was mustard, but I'm not sure. Whatever it was, I wouldn't get it. Um, it was messy, but I think that was just me. I don't know if it was me or if it was because like the turkey was sliding around in there. It was kind of like frozen on the outside, but it wasn't frozen all the way through. It was just like a little bit of ice on the outside of it, which I actually prefer. I'd rather know that it was it was cold than than warm. So um, I'm going to finish eating the cookie though. This this cookie is amazing. It's so good. I'm considering like, you know, I'm trying or thinking about cutting my sugar intake. So, I mean, this isn't something I'm going to be eating all the time, but this is a nice treat. Um, I do like this and it's, it's thick. You know, look at that. Mm. And like I said, it's warm. I don't know if they always serve it like that, but this one's warm and it's kind of like a little bit crisp on the outside but it's like softer in the middle it's really good mm. it was a pretty good sized cookie I mean I've had a lot of bites and they're still you know it's busy here today at Costco Pretty much any day we come, it's always busy here. I don't know if it's like that at all the Costco's, but we haven't found a time when we can come and it's it's not busy. It's so we were lucky to find like a, a decent parking spot here. All right, guys. So my wife has started eating her salad. One one thing we did notice. I'm not sure if these are supposed to come with croutons or not. Uh, but there's no croutons in this one. Um, but again, I don't know if that's something that they're supposed to come with or not. We just thought we saw croutons on the picture, but we could be mistaken. So it's like a huge chunk of like chicken here. Like just a huge like piece of it. Let me see here. I'm going to get some of the lettuce. And the sauce, I'm not sure. I think it's I think it's ranch, but don't, I don't know for sure. But I think that's what it is. Um, let's, let's start with some of the lettuce here. I like the lettuce. It's crunchy. It looks fresh. It tastes fresh. Let's try a little bit of the, the chicken here. Not like that. Yeah, there was like a hard piece in there. I'm not sure, like a piece of like, almost like cartilage or something. Anyways, yeah, be careful for that. You know, I didn't, when I started biting, I could feel it. It was really crunchy, so. Okay, the chicken tastes good. It tastes like chicken, you know, I mean, it, it, it's. Guys, I love to drink water. It's the main thing that I drink. Um, I don't drink a lot of other uh, like pop or soda or anything like that. I mean, I do a little like with some carbonated water, but I'm pretty much a water guy. So I think that the salad is really good. I think that the lettuce is good quality. I think that the chicken is good quality. Um, you know, the cheese that's in there is good quality in my opinion. And like I said earlier, I'm not a huge sauce guy. So, um, you know, as far as dressing goes, um, you know, I don't really like a lot of dressing, but I thought this dressing was okay. 
So I'm going to give you my my opinion, uh, my review on a number scale of one to 10. So we'll start with the salad since I'm holding this. So I think that this salad is an eight out of 10 salad. I think that it's a good salad. I think that it tastes fresh. I think that the ingredients that are in the salad are good ingredients, like good quality ingredients in my opinion. Um, but with that being said, I think there could be more to it. You know, it's a pretty basic salad. And again, I gotta see if we didn't get croutons and we were supposed to. I could be totally making that up, but um, we'll, we'll have to look when we go back in Costco. Um, the sandwich, I'm going to give the, the turkey sandwich, I'm going to give that a nine out of 10. I thought it was really good. Um, the only thing I would change is the sauce. I would just, um, you know, not have any sauce on it. And I don't know if it was messy from, again, the sauce or the turkey sliding around because it was kind of frozen on the outside, but it was a little bit messy, but um, that could just be me too. But overall, the sandwich, nine out of 10. Now the cookie, that cookie is amazing and dangerous for me because I'm probably gonna want it every time I come here. That cookie to me is a 10 out of 10. That's a really good cookie. Um, and like I said, it's kind of dangerous to me because I don't, like every time we come to Costco, I don't want to like get the cookie, but you know, ho hopefully I don't. Hopefully I just make it an every once in a while thing, but it is incredibly good. So, okay, so I think I got, you know, there there's three different ice creams like this. There's a strawberry, a vanilla, and then there's this swirl. And I've actually had the strawberry before, okay? And I'll talk about that shortly, but I haven't had the swirl yet. Um, I haven't had just the vanilla. I've had the ones with the syrup in them before, like with the strawberry syrup and the chocolate syrup. And then I've had just the strawberry ice cream. And yes, I have a fork here just because that's what um, I have. Let me see what, okay. So um, I'm going to test this out and, um, you know, give my review. A couple things I learned too. So the picture, um, when I was talking earlier about the croutons, the picture shows the croutons, but if you look at the items that it lists, it doesn't say croutons. So I don't know, and I didn't ask them. I didn't want to bother them uh, with that question, but um, I did see croutons there um, in the picture, but not listed in the ingredients. So I don't know. Um, and then also the sauce. So it said one of the sauce was like a mustard mayo spread. Um, I didn't really notice the mustard. It just looked like mayo to me, but I don't know. It said it was a mustard mayo spread. And then the other sauce that was on the top, like where the lettuce was, that was a sun-dried tomato spread is what that was. So, um, and I just go back to my original opinion. I just, I, I'm just not, I, I just don't really like a lot of sauce. So I, I would have been fine without the sauce. But okay, this thing's melting a little. Um, let's test this out and see what it tastes like. Oops, spill some on my seat. Mmm. It's kind of what it looks like. It's weird when, when I take some out, it's like, it just has a different texture. It's good. Um, it's good, it's creamy. I like it. I, I think I like the swirl better than just the straight strawberry. Um, it's a good ice cream. I probably prefer more the ones with syrup in them. Like I actually like the one with strawberry syrup. Um, and I just wanted to get this, you know, just like as a nice treat, I guess, even though I've had one with the cookie when we were done shopping. But typically, like I said, the, the cookie is dangerous for me because I'm going to think of that every time I come here. That's probably the, the sweet that I'm going to want. And it's, um, it's definitely a sweet cookie. I like that it was warm and I hope, you know, I, I don't know if they serve it warm like that all the time, but if they do, that, that was a really good way to serve it. Um, and you know, it was like soft on the inside and just like a little bit crisp on the outside. So I really like the cookie. So, all right guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. I'm going to take one more bite here. I got to give, I got to assign it a number on the one to 10 scale since I did with everything else. I'm going to give this, it's probably like an eight out of 10 is what I would give it. I like, I like the swirl more than I like, and I've tried, like I said, I tried the strawberry in the past, but I think preference wise, 
if I was gonna get an ice cream, I would probably get the one with the strawberry syrup. That's just the one I like. And I used to like the one with the chocolate syrup, but my wife got me onto the one with the strawberry syrup and I just like it more now. That's, that's the one that I like. And one thing that I wanted to say too, just in general, is that I think that it's a good idea to limit my sugar intake. Um, you know, this day I'm making a video about the new items at Costco, and these are treats for me, but this is not like a usual thing that I would like to do to eat this much sugar in one day. So, um, you know, I really like to try to limit the amount of sugar that I intake um, and really make it like a treat, like a special occasion, not like an everyday thing. So I just wanted to mention that to you guys, and, um, you know, you guys take it for or, um, you know, what you will. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment and if you have the time, check out these other great videos.